And another important thing we have to talk about, guys, in this situation, uh, if you remember, today I uploaded a video talking about Carlo Ancelotti in his very, very um, risky situation he's going through within Real Madrid. Right now, nobody can uh, trust, nobody can say, nobody can confirm Carlo Ancelotti will continue um, being the Real Madrid coach. Uh, either this season or even next season. Next season probably worst. So the thing is, is he going to continue in Real Madrid in case Real Madrid doesn't win anything or we get eliminated from the World Cup or whatever? Yes, it can happen. It's in a scenario that can happen. Doesn't mean though it's going to happen for sure. However, a lot of Madridistas want to start to speculate and uh, talk about the next coach or what would be the next coach for next season, either next season or even this season if Carlo Ancelotti gets sucked from Real Madrid, right? So um, there are three possibilities right now, real possibilities um, in Real Madrid for the next or possible potential next coach. Number one, Zinedine Zidane. Why? Because he's a person who has been, full, I mean, say for example, uh, footballistically raised in Real Madrid as a coach and pretty much as a player right within Real Madrid. So he knows very well the club. He knows the idiosyncrasy and of course he knows how the things were down in uh, Real Madrid. Okay. So another thing is Zidane is very popular within the French players and within the squad. So he might be the number one choice. The second one, the number two, would be Xavi Alonso. As you know, Xavi Alonso is a very well-beloved guy, very well-beloved player, a player who really played uh, for four nice, great years in Real Madrid. And that's why, and not only that, because he's also doing a great job in Bayer Leverkusen, is that's why um, a lot of people think he might be the right one to replace Carlo Ancelotti, okay? So he might be bring over fresh ideas, uh, fresh plans, I mean, new new um, tactics. Uh, I don't know. The guy is doing a great job, right? So that's why Ramadid is keeping an eye on him for now. And the third choice is, of course, Raul Gonzalez. As you know, Raul Gonzalez is managing the second team, Castilla. And of course, Raul Gonzalez has rejected, it was last Friday, one offer from Leeds United. So my opinion is these three players, I've been testing the waters a little bit. I've been talking to people about that and what they say, what they come up, what they come back with is the possibility of these three names more than any other name, including Tuchel or um, Jurgen Klopp or any other Nagelsmann. It's the same thing. These three coaches, these three I mean, play, former players are the ones, in my opinion, favorites to replace Carlo Ancelotti in our bench.